This is what Lou Zona, executive director of Youngstown's Butler Institute of American Art, had to say about Maple Turner III. He can go into a closet and in 20 minutes come out with a work of art. Turner's talent, says Zona, is in the elite category, which is why starting Sunday there will be a six-week exhibit of Turner's work at the Butler. This afternoon at Youngstown's Butler Institute of American Art, Maple Turner III guided me through the 65 pieces that are part of his exhibit. This is when President Clinton moved his office on 125th Street. Much of his work is of New York City, where he studied at the prestigious Parsons School of Design, and then shortly after 9-11, the Community College of New York. The first semester students hadn't showed up, and I start creating, creating. They called me the Maple Turner Factory. After 69 years, the Maple Turner Factory has turned out 195,000 pieces of art. When you put the 195,000, people don't believe you. They look at you like you're crazy. They look at me, they said, there is no way. Maple Turner first became interested in art at age six when his Lincoln Elementary class on Youngstown's east side visited the butler. And Turner laid his eyes on Sergeant Mrs. Knowles and her children. And I saw that big painting and I made up my mind. I said, one day I'm going to be an artist and one day my work going to be in the, this museum. And today, Turner's 125th Street Daytime in Harlem collage is part of the Butler's permanent collection, along with the pieces that are part of the exhibit, including one he did as an eighth grader, portraying Youngstown's Wick Avenue, for which he won an award at East High School. He just um, will take an idea and run with it. The Butler's executive director, Lou Zona, says Turner's style is all over the place, but he has a place in Youngstown. Well, Maple is part of Youngstown uh, artistic uh, heritage. He's a uh, wonderful talent. When someone at the Butler messaged him about doing an exhibit, Turner was bedridden after a four-stroke, his doctor telling him to get up. And because they let me have this show, I got up, and I'm walking, I'm moving, I'm creating art. Maple Turner moved home a dozen years ago to take care of his parents and still lives today on the east side. You can meet him on Sunday from 1 to 3 p.m. during a Meet the Artist event at the Butler. His exhibit will be on display in the Mazeros Gallery in the lower level until February the 26th.